the reason you keep up a wall is just because sometimes what comes through here is really hard to deal with. I mean, there's been really bad stuff come through here. And, and if you let it affect you, if you let it get deep down in your soul, I mean, you're just not going to be able to function here anymore. You know, I have volunteers who get very upset. You will have five baby robins and two will die. They go, oh my gosh, two have died. I say, yes. But think of it this way. If you hadn't been here, five have died. Three lived because you were here. There's a parable with the fire service, you know, when you arrive at the scene of a disaster and there's, there's people that are injured and property that's being damaged and people are suffering at that time or, or dead, um, you have to really keep in mind that you didn't cause it and you're there to alleviate that. You're there first and foremost to stop the process of injury and then to start the healing process. <laughs> 